Hi you guys, it's a video following on, on uh, my series on the MK808 Mini Android uh, PC. Uh, today I've purchased uh, a wireless keyboard uh, for the MK808 and uh, you could use it with all sorts of different devices. Uh, when you're buying this uh, device or a device for your MK808 or micro PC, you have to make sure that you get the right devices. There's no Bluetooth uh, inside the uh, MK808. This actually is a uh, a wireless uh, keyboard with uh, a wireless adapter that plugs into the uh, USB on the go cable or a USB uh, port. Uh, so I'll quickly get into this and looking quickly on the front it runs at 2.4 gigahertz LED backlight for the keys, lithium battery included so I'll quickly get into the box. Uh, this particular model is made by Woxter. Well, so straight away inside the box we've got the uh, charge cable which is a standard USB to mini USB cable that charges the the handset, the remote control handset. Uh, so look, pretty well packaged. Let's get this out of it. And there we have it, you can sort of see the size. It's uh, not much bigger than uh, Galaxy Note 2, pretty similar size in uh, dimensions I would say and we've got a a mouse pad one side, left right, left right uh, full uh, F uh, panel keys that you would see on a, a normal QWERTY keyboard on a laptop for instance, Numer numeric keys there full uh, uh, keyboard at the bottom with different functions uh, so look, we've got a trap door on the back and inside the trap door you can get it out is the actual dongle that will uh, plug into the on-the-go port or maybe the USB port. We'll have to try and both see which, which one it works best. It should be uh, plug and play. There's no uh, drivers really needed to set this up, so we'll uh, we'll give that a go. That uh, stores safely inside the uh, back trap door. I'll quickly put that back together. Uh, you can see a fairly straightforward uh, keyboard, so we'll have a go at that later. Also, what I purchased today, quickly went through a few other bits. I've actually got an Ethernet USB adapter. And now, the reason I've got this Ethernet USB adapter, we'll quickly get this out of the box as well. We can get into it. Playing around uh, with a micro uh, PC, what I've found is the, uh, the Wi Fi connection on the micro PC. It's okay, but it tends to uh, bounce around a bit and drop a little bit. If you're watching, certainly streaming uh, a movie or watching something, you may find you're losing connection. Uh, with a bit of research, I found out that the uh, generic USB to Ethernet port works fine. So, uh, depending on where your router is located, mine, uh, fortunately, is fairly close to the TV. So, what I'm going to try and do is jack this into uh, one of the ports on the uh, micro uh, PC. Uh, the Android MK808 and we'll uh, plug an Ethernet cable into the other end and directly connect it straight to uh, the router. Now in the settings on the MK808 when you go to uh, Wi-Fi connections there is a specific uh, panel in there for connecting via Ethernet so we'll give that a go after and see how, how that works especially uh, to stop any uh, loss of streaming for movies and uh, loss of connection on the Wi-Fi. Also, another thing I've uh, quickly bought today, uh, pretty standard again, it's just a standard USB cable and it's a female to male standard USB cable. Now the reason I bought this as well, looking on uh, different forums with the wireless keyboards, this particular model here and other models, uh, a few things have been said when the dongle is plugged directly into the back of the uh, MK808 or very near to it, there actually is some interference on the signal and the uh, the dongle. Uh, so what's been suggested on a few forums and seems to work quite well is to plug this into a separate uh, end of a USB cable, jack that into your on-the-go cable and that keeps your uh, Wi-Fi for your keyboard well away from the main board of the MK808. Uh, so we'll try all these things, see how they work together and see how they pan out. And I say there's the keyboard. We've got the uh, USB to standard Ethernet port. So a few other bits of kit that we're going to try out, although uh, most people will be probably using uh, this with uh, the adapter plug straight in the MK808. I would imagine it works okay, but there has been a lot said about the, uh, the distance of uh, workability for the keyboard. Some people are saying when it's directly plugged into the MK808, three meters range and you start to drop uh, 
letters as you type in but other people have said with an extension cable uh, the keyboard works fine up to 10 meters away so we'll have to give all these things a go and uh, we'll post that video of uh, these being tried out later on anyway give me a thumbs up give me a like uh, subscribe to my channel keep following this series and i'll get more videos at you soon thanks for watching